Okay, so welcome to Math Story, yeah? and let's solve this problem. So identify if the computed the value lies in the non-rejection region, or the acceptance region, or in rejection region. So we have this given the critical t value that's positive 1.318. So let's assume this one is positive 1.318. Then this area is the rejection region, and this area is the acceptance region. Then from this given computed value, that's positive 1.1, and 1.1 lies on this area. So therefore, the computed T value is at the acceptance region. Then for this event, so the critical T value, that's negative 1.67. So let's assume this one is negative 1.67. And this area is the rejection region. This area is the acceptance region. Then the computed T value, that's negative 2.45. And negative 2.45 lies on this area so therefore the computed t value is at the rejection region then for this given so the critical t value is at positive and negative 1.311 so let's assume this one is negative 1.311 and this uh, area is the rejection region and also positive 1.311 and this area is the rejection region and this one is the acceptance region then the computed t value that's negative 1.153 and negative 1.153 belongs to this area so therefore the computed t value is at acceptance region. Then for this given, so the critical t value of positive and negative 1.812. So let's assume this one is negative 1.812 and this one is the rejection region. And this one is positive 1.812. And this one is the rejection region. And this area is the acceptance region. Then the computed T value is positive 1.915. And positive 1.195 lies on this area. So therefore, the computed T value is at the rejection region.